Uh, yo, my my client just crashed. No way, bro. What? Oh my thank fuck. Gee, wh what? I I'm not gonna lie. That um. That makes me not want to use Reinlight anymore, but I have to because of the GPU plugin. Like if Jackx had a client that had the GPU mode on, so then I could play it on a laptop, then that would be fantastic. But unfortunately, I can't. Otherwise, my frames drop to like 20 because my CPU on this laptop is too shit. So yeah, this is... I don't know what to do. Like, I want to continue PKing, but this is scary. How in the world did I live as well? Maybe when I did the double spec, the guy just decided to tab, and then I was just sat there, like, completely AFK. Now, I headed into the support section of Runelight Discord, and it turns out I'm not the only one that is experiencing this crashing issue. By the looks of it, the only fix that is currently available is switching from the 64-bit client down to the 32-bit client. According to the Runelight devs, it has something to do with a recent update Jagex did. But yeah, if you guys plan on risking a lot of money, I highly recommend you switch to the 32-bit client until they fix the 64-bit client. But Jagex Gex, please just put in a bit of effort, make a client that is actually good or better than Runelight or buy out Runelight or some shit because my god. The shit jam flex. There's a tiny claw spec as well. I should have hit big with the claws. Oh, we got him. GG, bro. Okay, I think this is max. I saw that my health was a little bit low, so I had a feeling it was gonna go for an anti-spec, and it worked out well. Pretty much all of it. Yo, that's actually my first max KO in a long time. Nice. Okay, total loot, 33.2 mil. I'll take it. I was hoping you'd get like claws or something, but I'm still happy with 33 mil. All right, guys, we're gonna pause the video real quick and talk about today's sponsor, Wondershare Filmora 10. Now, if you don't know what Filmora 10 is, then I shall explain. It is the latest editing software, which is great for beginners and even experienced people such as myself. I have tested and used this program for quite a while now, and it hasn't let me down. If I'm being honest, learning to edit can be quite difficult, especially for a beginner, and that is why I recommend Filmora, because they make editing 100 times easier. The software is really easy to use. I can import my media to the timeline and crop it to the side that I want and then I can cut it up and add some transitions some effects and it's honestly just as easy as that it provides you with everything you need from a huge list of effects transitions filters and even royalty free music and sound effects which can be super important on top of that this latest version now has features like motion tracking keyframes color match audio ducking and many many more they also have a YouTube channel filled with endless tutorials just to make it a little bit easier so if you're interested in editing videos by yourself then Filmora 10 is definitely the way to go it's super easy and it's even free to try and the trial version has every everything you need to get started. So if you want to get started on your editing journey, then just go to the top of my description, click the link that you see at the top and download Filmora 10 right now. Comment what you think of Filmora using hashtag create with Filmora to win a one year free license. Maybe. Oh, 70 fire. Only if only I had pid, bro. Why are you running? Why are you running? How much food he has left? Ah, I think that's it. 
Damn, that potential. Dead... what? Okay then. Hmm. That was pretty easy. 835k. I guess it's one of the easiest one mills I've ever made. Is he dead? No way he survived that. So freaking lucky. My god. KO. GG. And we get not bad at all. 5.6 mil. It's the first BK we've run into in a while as well. It's kind of pog. Like, Ferox is pretty much the only place where you can run into consistent NHPKs, like over and over again. But even then, right now, this is peak time, and this is pretty much it. a bulk chance. What? A one? On that HP? He is not happy. Oh, I forgot I forgot a looting bag again, bro. 169k. Not the best, but there's always some high potential. Alright, guys, this is gonna be it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. So sorry I couldn't get as many clips as I usually do. Unfortunately, the wilderness just does not have a lot of PKs in it anymore. Unfortunately, the wilderness has gotten to a point where it's pretty much just clans running around. Like it takes hours just to find a single solo PK, and usually they're a bait for a clan anyway. So hopefully the wilderness changes that are coming in a few months changes all that, but I'm not getting my hopes up. Not gonna lie. But yeah, guys, that is it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you all probably tomorrow. What are you waiting for? Do it! Yes, I'm real.